my god, I haven't done this in so long. Where the fuck do I start? Hi. Alex says hi. Right, I need to apologize right now for these cats because they're gonna drive me absolutely insane. We're gonna have to just deal with it because they live here. <laughs> Um, hi. I haven't done this in so long. So much has changed, as you could probably tell. I'm gonna come back once I've done my hair because this is ridiculous. Yeah. <laughs> right, my hair's... Okay, this is gonna... Shh, yeah, okay, go ahead. I've done this in so long. There's many reasons why. One of them you can probably tell is my hair's purple. Um, I'm in a different house. Uh, I've shaved off all my hair. <laughs> and you might think, oh Abby, you're having a that breakdown. Girl, I'm not. I'm actually not. I'm living my best fucking life. Oh, let me tell you. Um, there is a big, big secret that I'm not going to disclose on here yet. Because not everybody knows. Once everybody knows, I will tell it. But as of now, it's a secret. Um, today actually is my birthday. It's the 7th of September, 2020. It's my birthday and I thought I'm just gonna film. I'm gonna just speak life because my life has been fucking mental these past few months. One of them being me and the ex are no longer together. Best fucking decision I ever made. If you're in a relationship and you ain't happy, get the fuck out of it, hon. And that's what I'm gonna say on that. Um, I just did my nails and I literally can't do nothing with them so there's no way I'm going to get a fucking necklace on. We was in quarantine. I filmed actually in quarantine and I lost it. I lost everything. I lost the whole thing. I think I vlogged for like a week and I bloody lost like all of it. So I might vlog again. I probably will but we're obviously not in quarantine so like it's maybe more interesting. <laughs> I've m moved into this house. This is just my wee little pad. I love it. I love my house. Um, it's not perfect. It will be very soon, hopefully. But as of now, it's not. It's my little humble abode and I love it. I don't know what I'm doing to my face. I want to do like a euphoria like sort of look, but I kind of want to get gems. So I'm just going to put on like a really light bit of makeup. Actually go into my, my sister's just for supper. Like I'm not, we're not doing anything crazy. I'm trying to think what else has like changed. There's so much changed. I'm also sick, so excuse my voice, like it's really sore, but I want to film. A lot of like cuts because I'm gonna keep coughing. So. <laughs> yeah. Um I'm gonna shove on the Ulla Hendrickson but I don't remember. I don't remember the last time I used this makeup. I really don't. I need to get rid of makeup so bad. Um I have so much that I just do not use and whatever I do use it's not a lot of so I need to get rid of it and I don't like giving makeup to like my sister because she doesn't use it sorry Katie but you don't like Katie does not wear makeup we went out the other week when obviously a lot of restrictions were like easing and whatever and um she, I literally watched her put on her makeup she did mascara she, no she doesn't do mascara because she's allergic to mascara she literally did powder bronzer and that was it and highlighter and I was like is that literally no foundation just that I was like we're completely different people <laughs> I think I definitely got my I don't always this but my love for makeup stems from my childhood when my cousin Tyler used to play with makeup at our nanny's house that's why I love makeup that's why I'm like just obsessed <laughs> I need my drink what else have I done during lockdown my hair's purple, I think I said this, but it's really, I just dyed it yesterday and it's so purple and I love it. And it's newly washed, these clips are not gonna say it. I started to read, like, well, it's supposed to be a few months ago, I was reading the... Look, it's Alex. Also the cats are huge, Piper is so big. Um, Wolvie well, is not supposed to be up there, but he sits up there all the time and it drives me insane. I was literally saying something. Oh yeah, I'm reading the Harry Potter books. Fun fact, I've never, I've read to like, 
I think like the third one and then I stopped because like the, the one I'm reading just now is absolutely massive. It's like the fourth, the fourth, fifth book are like huge and I must have just thought, nah, I ain't reading this. But I have nothing else to do while in quarantine, while lockdown restrictions are kind of like all weird. That's what I've been doing. I've been enjoying it. I pre-ordered uh, the Magpie Society. I just thought it sounded so good. So I ordered that. It pre-ordered. It doesn't come until October. Well, I've decided I'm going to order the Hunger Games books because I've never watched the movies. And my friend Peter and Jamie and Lauren, they said to read the books, then watch the movies. So that's what I'm going to do because they're on Netflix. If they're not, I'll get them on Amazon Prime, hopefully. Another thing that's really exciting that happened in lockdown is I got added to a TikTok group. I was added to two. The first one was Amy and Jamie. Then I got introduced to Lauren and Peter. They're all from Northern Ireland. Ireland? No. Is it Ireland? Ireland. I th I'm just going to say Ireland. <laughs> I'm not sure. But Amy's from England. I don't actually remember where. Um, and like we're all going to meet up one day, we zoom quite a lot, we speak all the time, we snapchat every fucking day, I just, I love them so much. I need to like do something, like I, this is the thing, I'm going to start speaking and I'm not going to keep putting on makeup, so, oh my god, there's going to be so much like cuts in this. So yeah, I met them and then I got added to another group, um, which is... A whole bunch of girls, um, a whole bunch of girls from like literally all over the world and we talk, we Zoom, we have Zoom parties, like we literally do everything, we speak all the time. I would class these few, like the people I've met on TikTok alone, like some of my really close friends now because like I have been able to tell them like more than I would like my own friends at home, which is crazy. Crazy lockdown and they have made it so much easier. So I'm very thankful to all of them. They all know who they are. Like I will name them if you want, but like there's so many of them I'm scared to forget somebody. So you guys know who you are. I love them so much. But like we are all planning on meeting up and I'm so excited for it. I just cannot wait to meet them. Like I just cannot wait. I don't know if this is a bad idea doing this while I'm fucking ill, but <laughs> here we are. I don't know, like I've, and I've said I'm not going to be doing full glam, but watch this face become full glam. Yeah, I don't know when we'll be meeting up. I really hope it's soon. But with lockdown and stuff, it's kind of been like on hold. But we're just going to wait until everything's nice and safe. I don't know what makeup, like what am I putting on my face? I don't want to put on anything crazy, to be quite honest. I might just put on like a CC cream. So what have all you guys been doing while I've been away? I want to know all the gossip. All of the, the things you've been up to. Also, I dyed my flipping eyebrows on Tuesday with this. This Maybelline tint. I don't know if I got the wrong colour or if I did it wrong, but they're ginger. They're actually not as bad now, but like, see, when I first did it, they were just like ginger. And I was like, oh, what have I done? Also, these earrings. These are from a shop from the girl who's in a group with me, Alex. She makes them. I'm going to leave that in the... What is that little bit called? Description box? To her Etsy. Because she makes like the nicest flipping jewellery. So yeah, I love her stuff. I need to actually stop going on it because I keep buying stuff that I do not need. But I just, I love it. I just need to have it all. I'm going to put on this e.l.f. glow lotion. I don't know why I'm just doing it. I'm also getting ready because I want to make TikToks. Like, I've been ill all this week and I've not been able to do anything TikTok wise take pictures, put on makeup, like, I am going to get back into, like, YouTube and social media, but this is the thing. I'm the type of person that, like, I think about what everybody else thinks about me so much. I don't know why, I just always have. I've always just thought, well, if I put this up, what are they going to all think? And I just need to stop thinking like that because I'm going to drive myself insane, first of all. And I'm also not going to be doing what I absolutely love, which is social media. Like, I just love like editing, filming, editing photos, taking photos, getting dolled up and taking a photo. I just, it, I don't know why, I just absolutely love doing that. But I've kind of been put off because of my noggin telling me they're going to think 
you look shit, don't do it. So we're cha I'm just not listening to myself anymore, I'm just doing it. <laughs> I'm talking so much rubbish, but I haven't talked for like a week and now I just can't shut up. <laughs> I do not know what foundation I want to put on my face. Right, we're just putting on this one that end story. I need a brush. I also need washing brushes, which I always put off because I literally hate doing it. I'll tell you what foundation I was loving for like a good few weeks and I was just putting on makeup for the sake of putting on makeup is this. This NYX Total Control Drops, this, that is, it's so good. This one I forget is actually, <gasps> well, you need to be shook. We're gonna just use this seat, no. Oh, I've been watching so much like TV. What else, Netflix, YouTube, like that's all I've done pretty much while we've been in lockdown. I've just finished the fall, that is so amazing. If you have Netflix, I would definitely recommend that. Um, it's about a serial killer. I love stuff like that as well. Like, it's my go-to thing to watch. And a fair bit through the Orphan Black, that's so good as well. What else? I literally watched so much stuff I couldn't even tell you. Selling Sunset. That is such good trash TV. Trash. I'm not fucking American, but you know what I mean? Like, just rubbish TV. Like, just something you can chuck on, not really have to pay attention to, but like, same time you're like glued to it. Oh, it's so good. Like, can you guys sit down? Because you're really bothering me walking past my flipping background, thanks. Uh, I don't even know, remember what else I've watched. I've watched so much stuff. I can't believe I'm 23. I've also started to journal. Um, I think I've journaled for like, maybe like a week or so. Um, some stuff are, like, just to get out of my brain because I... I'm very bad at bottling up stuff, like, I've always done that. I'm really bad at doing that, actually. So, I started to journal, and it's really helping. Also, there's a thing on the internet. I think it's called Future Me. I'm going to be doing that as well. Like, I just want to, like... Does anybody else's TV do that? Just go on and then go off? Like it's clicked itself on now, it's gone off, but it doesn't turn on the screen, it just makes like a ticking noise. No, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not even going to say what I think I'm thinking because they're not even. Nope. There isn't one in here, and I don't want to pretend there is. <laughs> what was I saying before the TV interrupted me? Um. Oh my god, I literally forgot. Oh yeah, the future me thing. Like, I'm gonna do that tonight, maybe. So I do recommend journaling if you have like, not like I'm, like I have a like bad mental health. There's some of you guys know, so like that really helps my mental health. It might help some of you guys if you're struggling, but like it might not. Like sometimes things can make it better, sometimes it can't. I would recommend like you try it, and if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Like not everything works for everybody. So. It was my mom's birthday on the second. We had supper and she reacted to WAP. If you know the song, you know the song. Um, I put it on my TikTok. <gasps> That's another thing. TikTok. Obsessed. If you have TikTok, please follow me. <laughs> I want a thousand subscribers so bad I can go live because like, I just want to be able to interact with like, I just love making like internet friends now. Like I'm obsessed. So, <laughs> I'm gonna leave my TikTok like on the screen as well as my Instagram. And you can go and follow me. I just love TikTok. And my mom's getting so annoyed at me. Because I keep like doing the dances and singing the songs. That's the whole point of TikTok, to piss off your family, so. Um I've had so many birthday messages today. Like, I love when people say have a birthday to you. It just makes you feel like just nice. I'm just TikTok obsessed, if I'm quite honest. Um, that's all I do. For hours and hours and then I'll be on my phone and like I always will have passed like where did the time go? <laughs> I'm also on another TikTok group from people that are like from like America. Um and they're amazing as well. I've just made so much internet friends and I'm just I love it. Like if I hadn't put myself on TikTok and like commented on these groups, I would never know these people. And it was really out of my comfort zone. Like I'm not a confident person. Like I'm really not. A lot of people think I am, I'm really I'm not. So for me to even like comment and then be added, I was just like, oh my god. Like, yeah, I'm glad to have 
more fans. <laughs> There's like, I have really bad like spot congestion here and it's driving me insane. Also in the comments, tell me videos you want to see. Tell me your favorite YouTubers. Tell me anything you want. I want to interact with you guys more. Who's ever watching this, leave a comment. Oh, last night, Piper is obsessed with pulling down my washing. I have it hanging on like a clothes horse. Obsessed pulling it down. So I got woken up at half past seven this morning. This is why I got so much energy to do this because I've been up since half past seven. Which I wasn't complaining. I wanted to get up early anyway because it's my birthday. Like I wanted to just make most of the day by her pulling in one of my sports bras. I'm unsure why. It sounded like a dead body. It sounded like she was dragging a dead body along the floor. Like, I'm not even kidding. <laughs> so that woke me up. And I can go back to sleep. Also, guys, I haven't been meaning to, but I've been losing a lot of weight. Which I'm not mad about, but I, I'm not meaning to. I haven't been trying to. So, I'm kind of happy with my body right this minute. Like, I cannot wait to go out, put on a nice dress, and it fit me all the right places. Like, just be nice on my body, feel good about myself again. Like, because I used to hate how I looked. I think that's another reason why I stopped doing YouTube, because I started to hate the way I was looking. Like, on camera, just in general. I'm glad that I've lost weight. Because I feel so much better about myself now. Holly! Holly! I also cannot wait to go and get a piercing, get my tattoo finished, start a new tattoo. I'm just so buzzing to get tattooed and piercings and I'm just going to go mental when I can. I know it's what I do just now but like I need to save up money. What else? I'm so excited. This is, sh this brush is shredded. Get off me. Um, oh, right, I need to change brushes here because this one's pissing me off. Also I'm excited. Because I don't actually know what's happening today for my birthday. Like, before I've really known, like, I've known, like, everything that's happening or been able to guess what's happening. Today I don't. Like, I literally don't know anything, which is making me so excited. Oh, I think I'm watching a lot of the Kardashians. Like, I'm trying to, like, watch that again from, like, the start. I, don't, I forget how much drama there is in that programme, and it's brilliant. That's another like, good programme to watch if you're, like, bored, but want something that's really easy to watch is the Kardashians. Obviously, if you like the Kardashians, if you don't, then don't watch it, but... I love the Kardashians. Also, I can't wait for Teen Mum to come on again. I love Teen Mum. That might be so weird for some people, but I absolutely love it. I, I've watched them since they were just like wee. And my hair's in actually really good condition considering that I've been dyeing it like every month. Um, I might do, like this is the thing, like I need to be careful what I do next because I do not want to like have it go weird. It doesn't look bad when it's like growing out, to be honest with you, you can't really tell. I'm not sure what colour. I really do like the purple though. Like it's very, like in your face but also really subtle. Um, I did so much research before I like decided what colour I was going to do and stuff because I didn't want to fuck my hair. Like there's been so much happening but at the same time like there's not. Like right? nails match my straw. That's made my day. I need powder under my eyes because they're creasing. I hate my under eyes. They really get on my nerves. They constantly crease. Which obviously because I've got wrinkles but also I cannot say I'm going to because Alex knows what that means. So if I say it, he'll come running through. Which is so cute. He loves her. And I do another Q&A. Because so much stuff has changed. I'm also getting very good if I do so myself at doing my nails. These are um, acrylic tips, all done by me. So I did them this morning while I was watching the fall. Um, yeah, I'm just really enjoying doing my nails. My natural nails are really long, which is great. Like I've never had long natural nails. I'm a very bad biter. Always have done. It's just an anxiety thing. I'm so glad that they're starting to grow. I'm trying to 
break the habit. It's very hard though when you've got anxiety. You need to constantly bite your nails. I forget how long eyebrows take me. So I might come back once I'm finished because these are taking me forever. Right. Going to. Um, I'm obsessed with my Fenty Beauty bronzer. It's so easy to build up, like it doesn't go on like super crazy. I never know how to talk about it because I just talk so much in the beginning. <laughs> That's why I always do that. I really get on my nerves and I like talk about everything at the start because I'm so like nervous but also just want to get the video finished as soon as possible to get it up that I forget that I don't need to speak like about everything at the start. Plus my throat is really starting to hurt again. I've got so much I could say, but I actually can't, which is annoying. So much drama. And I literally can't say nothing. Oh well. That's life. That's what all people say. Oh God, I've not heard that song in ages. <laughs> Am I allowed to sing? Like, I get copyrighted if I sing. Hey, Siri. If I sing filming a YouTube video, will I get copyright? Okay, I found this on the web for if I sing YouTube video, will I get copyright? No, Check it out. Not what I asked. I suppose I wouldn't because like people sing like cover of songs on TikTok uh, on fucking YouTube. So I'm gonna sing some of my favourite songs. <laughs> um, one of them is WAP. Which I think is inappropriate to sing. So. I'm singing in my head, by the way. Uh, what's another one? Oh, I like the song Dirty Talk. Oh no, it's not called Dirty Talk. It's called something else. <laughs> you know what? Let's just forget about it. Because I just can't. I can't sing any of my songs. Because they're all flipping dirty songs. I think I won't, like... There's one, like, there's one artist I don't think I'll ever, ever, ever get sick of, and that is Eminem. Obsessed with Eminem. That's what all the people say. I've got that bloody song in my head now. I can't remember how the whole thing goes. That's what all the people say. Riding shotgun, getting shot down in me. That's not the word. That's fine. I don't remember what the words are. After this, I'm having a cup of tea and a biscuit. Because I'm starving. I'm trying not to eat a lot because I won't eat my supper that Katie's going to make. And I hate wasting food. So. Oh my goodness, that was a way to go squint. If I had not stopped myself. I might have a wee read as well. I'm just spoiling myself this birthday. I'm just doing what the fuck I want. Not having nobody else to answer to is amazing. I would love to like go out and just celebrate my birthday at the pub though. Especially being like, this is like my first birthday in five years single. I just, that blows my mind. Also, it's a Monday, so it's kind of an annoying day to have a birthday. Cause like, if I was to do anything, it would have been yesterday. Like on like Saturday, like two days ago, so. Annoying, but. We're gonna move on. Like it's not. I can't help it. It's just the birthday falls on that day, and that's it. Like I'm sure I've seen something just walk along like there. I think it was just my hair. It better have been. Also, obsessed with blush. Like always happy. I think more so now than before. But and a wee bit on the nose. I like to put some here as well. I don't even know why. I just do. It's kind of where like the sun would naturally hit. I think. I hope I learned that from. I learned that from somebody because I would never know that on my own. <laughs> my throat feels like it's swallowed powder. I'm being serious. It's disgusting. That's what all the people say. Run, shotgun, getting shot down in me. That's not the words. Why am I saying that? It's not even the words. I shall what we're doing with my ass. Hmm. <laughs> See if I sing that song one more time. 
I will put myself in the bin. I'm taking. <sighs> yeah. Who put that there? Mm. Well, was that you? I'm gonna take the Morphe Jeffy Star. I was like, so why did I even question that? What are they gonna take? I'm gonna take Lynn, which is like this one here. Get rid of these creases. You know what I want to know? I would love to know is what the academy's like while the corona's going on. Cause I don't really know anybody from the academy that goes to like the academy, so like, I can't ask them. But well, I wonder what it's like. I wonder if they've got. They've probably got to wear a mask. Like, I'm sure they would have to. I also wonder what lipstick I'm gonna put on. I always have my dilemma with lipstick. Like it's literally the bane of my life trying to pick music. Music. Lipstick. Like drives me insane. See if I sing this. What is this song even called? Hey Siri, what is this song called? Riding shotgun. Hang on, let me listen. Riding shotgun, getting shot down in me. That's not the words. But it reminds me of something. I don't remember what it is. Hmm. I can't a... seem to recognise this song. Yeah, me neither, hon. It's driving me bonkers. If anybody knows what song I'm singing, can you put it in the comments? Because it's going to drive me insane. Men's... <clears throat> no, I love that Snapchat is all presents. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh my, this, right. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing with my eyeballs. I'm going to take, oh, that, that, <laughs> I just seen like the name of one of the um, shadows and it's called Channel. My sister's friend got a doll called Ch uh, Chanel and she called it Channel. It was the funniest bloody thing I've ever heard all fucking year. <laughs> oh, it was brilliant. I'm taking Mr. Diva and just putting it in the wee crease. I'm in such a hyper mood all of a sudden, it's really, really not good. <laughs> Who put a mark on my wall? Well, I'm gonna blame you because you're always bloody jumping the height of yourself for no reason, sweetheart. I'm quite surprised none of the cats have annoyed me because you know when I'm not filming, they drive me fucking insane and today there has been no issue, which is kind of concerning because I now wonder why they always have to annoy me when I'm not filming, but I um, shouldn't be complaining really, should I? What time is it? <sighs> Take it Mandy is not coming here, thank God, because I ain't fucking ready. I keep like hearing the car and I'm just like shit, is that her? But it's not. There's so much concentration right now, it's unbelievable. <laughs> Alright, I just took Mr. Diva and Channel and done that. And then 1985. I'm just gonna put it here. Also, I cannot wait to go on holiday. I've been thinking about this quite a lot. I can't wait to meet like the people I'm like met through TikTok, but I also can't wait just to go on holiday with my sister and my mum. Like I really want to go to Greece. I've never been to Greece and it's just, it, mm, it looks absolutely amazing. My all time destination for sure. Is it Mykonosis in Greece? Because it is, I would like to go there because I've seen that on Hannah, Hannah, Rachel and Maddie's vlog and it just looked unreal. Put it all over the lead. I'm um, literally used the same brush for this whole look. I'm going to curl my eyelashes. I'm going to do it maybe. <laughs> Kind of so much of Jack and Hill. And she did put on quite a lot of mascara, but I don't want a lot, a lot, lot on. I'm just gonna put on a few coats. I need to get a new mascara. This is probably dried up by now, like no joke. Oh, she also has to like look down into a mirror. Right, this is amazing. I would have never thought to like look into a mirror like that while doing my like my mascara. And like these some M ones would drive me insane because I could never get them all. And I've literally just got them all in like one little swipe. 
I'm sure you guys have heard this a million times by every YouTuber, but if you get mascara on your face at any point, anywhere, any amount, do not touch it until it's dry and then pick it, like, pick it off with a Q-tip and it will not ruin your makeup. No words of lie. Right, and then we're going to put on this one. This is the L'Oreal Paradise one. I don't know if this is exactly the way she did it, but it's very similar. And then she said to always wipe your eyelash curler once you've done one eye so you don't tear off your eyelashes. So this is how you get look like false looking eyelashes, which I all love that. If I got wipes in here, I knew I didn't. I knew it. I'm doing I like wiping it every time because you don't you don't you don't want to rip out your eyelashes. Make sure they're all in the mango squeeze. Hmm, I don't like these. What is that? <laughs> I, I don't actually put on mascara afterwards, but I'm gonna do it because, like, I ain't going about like that. My lashes look so long. What's next? Highlighter! My favourite bit of makeup! <laughs> right, highlighter. I want to use something different because I always use my Jack and Hell stuff. But it's just so good. But no, I'm using something different. <gasps> this, this, yeah. I have not. Oh my god, no! This. Mm. Jeffrey Star or Beauty Bay. Beauty Bay. I have not used this in years. Mm -hmm. ah. I love when movie does that. Do you want to say hello? Listo. Come say hi. Come say hi, Bobby. Right. I am. This is the with my best light brilliance palette. I've got strobe, charmed, radiant, or shine bright. Mm. I use radiant and a little bit of charmed. This one and this one. I haven't really shown you guys what I'm using, but it was more just a wee bit of an update, a wee bit of a chat because. It's my birthday, a lot of things have changed. I'm looking forward to the future and my new life. And yeah, just happy. So that's what we asked for. Look at that. Oh. I need to start using that more. A setting spray. I'm gonna use two. I'm gonna use my lavender one from MAC. Oh, I love the smell of that. I put so much powder on my face all the time. I always use the hydro hydrochloric fixing, hydrating and plumping setting spray by Revolution. woken up and it's gone like this so I might just leave it you know maybe put some like mo like mousse in it because it's really frizzy up there I'm gonna move back a little bit ah! <laughs> I thought it was gonna fall I'm not gonna put all the mousse I say that and I've got fucking loads in my hand And I'm gonna put in the shine spray by Mark Hill because it's very good. And this baby here, I don't know where it's come from, but it's doing my boxing. Right. A lipstick. Oh. See, picking lipstick is the bane of my life. Let's do this. Does need sharpened? Yep. Of course it does. All my fucking pencils need sharpened. Right, this is in, what is this? London. I'm gonna put on, what is this? Number 10, trust your gut. I'm gonna put 
a lot of fussy from um, Jack and Hill on. And then we're gonna do. I do, do Fenty Beauty in Fenty Gold. I need to get the new ones of these because they look absolutely amazing. Mmm, pretty. Took me all the time in the world to do that. But. Oh, yes, I like the lip. Well, guys. We are done. It was very nice to talk to you all again. I have missed. YouTube so much so this will not be the last you will see of me I will be back I have no idea when um but I hope you guys enjoyed the video hope you enjoyed, enjoyed our catch up and I will see you in the next video bye guys thanks for watching the video like comment subscribe all the good stuff and I'll see you in the next one bye